the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. And for this Blocks Fruits video, I am going to show you how to upgrade your Observation Hockey. Wait, Gamer Nom, what is Observation Hockey? That is a type of hockey that will help you dodge your skills. There you go. Depending on your mastery, the higher your mastery, the more dodges you can do. You can unlock this in C1. Guys, I have a video of this. Just check it in my channel. But for this video, we're going to upgrade it. So first off, you need to go to the Floating Turtle. There you go. Guys, look at this guy. Here is the instructions, the directions. Straight, turn to your right. And F, there you go. You see that pineapple looking tree house? There you go. Talk to the hungry man. After that, for the first requirement, guys, you need to master your observation hockey, meaning 5,000 observation hockey. How do you check your observation hockey? Go back to the first C. Talk to yourself. This is where you'll get your observation hockey too. There you go. But gamer norm, that is C1. I don't want to go back there. That's so far away. Is there another way to know if you've maxed out your observation hockey? Yes, there is. Guys, if you've maxed your observation hockey, you will have this title. There you go, the Ultra Instinct. Okay, so make sure to check that first. If you have that, I'm quite sure you've already mastered your observation hockey. How do you master it? Guys, just keep on using it. Is there a faster way? Yes, after using your observation hockey, just reconnect. Yes, leave the game and go back. After that, you already have full hockey again. Okay? Okay, so after that, Again, talk to the hungry man, and if you have a full mastery, he will tell you this. Bring me a decent meal, etc, etc. So now, you need to look for three fruits, okay? Three fruits. The location of the fruits, first up here. Guys, I'm not gonna fast forward it because I don't want you to get confused, okay? From top of the treehouse. There you go, just go straight, straight, there you go. And on top of this mountain, there you go, bundok. <laughs> You will find the first fruit, the apple. There you go. So after getting this, next stop. Our next apple is located in the great tree. So to make it easier, let's start with the spawn point. There you go. And you just need to fly. There you go. And on that mountain again, our next fruit is located. I think that's the banana. <laughs> Who loves banana here, guys? Okay. There you go. There's the banana. There you go. Okay, for our third fruit is the starting island of the third sea, the port town. So again here from the quest giver, just fly towards that direction. There you go. And here, this house. This is where you'll see the pineapple. There you go. Okay guys, so after locating those three fruits, there you, go. you just need to go back again. To the floating turtle, there you go. Talk to the hungry man. Guys, read this. Okay, let's talk to him. Hey, <laughs> I'm a picky person. He wants to eat the fruits in a bowl. So you need to find a bowl for him, guys. <laughs> okay, so where do we find that bowl? Don't worry, guys. I got you. Let's go to our next quest. First, guys, do you know where the mansion is located in this area? So we're heading to that area. There you go. Just follow this route. What if you've already saved in the mansion? Then that's better. Okay. So once you reach the mansion, talk to the citizen. He will ask you to defeat 50 forest pirates. Where is the forest pirates located? Or where I'm going to show you. Guys, do this quest. 200 million experience. Here is it located, guys. There you go. Just... Up there, and here is the quest giver, but don't get that quest, okay? Don't get a quest from him. Stick on your quest. Here is the forest, forest pirate. Okay, time to defeat them. We're gonna fast forward this, okay? Showcasing our uh, claw version 2. There you go. Well, anyway, let's finish this. Once you've reached or defeated 50, check that out, guys. Four level ups. Not bad. Go back to the citizen go and after that again he will thank you and ask you to do another quest defeat the captain elephant this is located near the forest pirates 
Gamer no Madre, any tips to defeat this? Guys, just maintain your distance. Using Light Fruit made it a lot easier. There you go. Let's fast forward it, guys. Let's say we've defeated it. There you go. Okay, so here we go. I've been defeated. I accept my defeat. Blah, blah, blah. It's normal. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. So after that, again, we will go back to the citizen. He will avenge me, that man. Okay, uh, who's that man, guys? Comment it on the comment section. So anyway, let's go back to the citizen. Okay. After this, we're almost done. There we go. Okay, let's read it. Town is now safer. I heard that... Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we're gonna find something. And after that, he will give us the bow. Okay? So from this gate... We are going to look for the Masketeer's hat, okay? So from this gate, just fly, go straight, go straight, go straight. Okay, let's check it out. Those three mushrooms, that is the location. Any other landmarks? This quest giver here, there you go. If you're look, just looking for landmarks. Okay, next up, there's a wall here. Just use your skills. There you go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. There you go. You see that, guys? There's an opening. Wait. <laughs> ah. Okay. Okay, finally. So once you enter it, you will get the Masketeer hat. Oh, we are now respected in Thailand. Go back to the citizen. And he will give you the bowl and arrange the fruits for you. Okay, guys. So, that's it. Now, time to go back to the Hungry Man. Oh, it really looks good. Yeah. yeah from now on, I'll prefer eating on a bowl. <laughs> okay. So, now after talking to the Hungry Man. Okay, delicious. Now, give us our reward. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Guys, so finally, for the last requirement, you need 5 million belly to unlock. The upgraded version of Observation Hockey. There you go. So again, faster cooldown for the dodges. There you go. Very nice. And also, you will be able to see what fruit, fight style, or sword your enemy is using. For example, this guy, Joy Boy, is using Light Fruit and Electric. So you can see what he's about to use. Okay. So here are the benefits again you can see. And also, faster cooldown, right? Or recharge of the observation hockey charges there you go we have nine so far i think this will really help you in bounty hunting to choose your enemies etc so again guys that's it i hope that this video will help you unlock the observation hockey again to all the viewers subscribers supporters i appreciate you all next up enma and fastest guide to leveling up to max level 2000 okay again this is gamer gamer out